you have someone keeping tabs on you and trying to communicate with you um, telepathically through dreams and songs. Um, so if certain songs pop up in your head or um, you could be having some strange dreams or some thoughts, there's someone trying to communicate with you. You may not be talking to this person and whoever this person is, they're hoping and praying and yearning for you. It's like they want to see you or they want to bump into you or they want to talk to you, whatever. There's something that happened here in the past between you and someone, whether it's a family member or this is someone who you have a family with or this someone could be trying to connect with your family and friends in your inner circle um, to try to stay close to you in some way. Um, this person is planning to pop up on you, spontaneous, unexpected, and surprise visit. Whoever this person is, they, um, yeah, they're, they're planning to make some type of um, pop up here when it comes to you. Who is this person? Who is this person? How would the collective know who this is? King of Swords, could be an air sign, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, someone who, um, they want to talk to you, they have something they want to say, what is it that this King of Swords wants to say? Tower, that they've been experiencing a very difficult time or something has come out, they found out something or something has come crumbling down, Ace of Swords. They want to speak the truth about why something came down, why something happened, or maybe tell you, bring some clarity to you about what they've been going through with this tower wise, the tower here. Justice. Okay, so I'm getting the feeling that someone has been going through a very difficult time. They've been going through um, maybe some legal issues. Yeah, five of wands and the king of cups. Someone's, there are two kings out here. <laughs> someone this king of sword here has been going through a very difficult time um something has come down um but i feel that with the justice card something is being made right or someone wants to make something right concerning whatever came crumbling down there's been fights and conflict there may have been multiple people in in disputes and arguments around the situation between you and this king of sword person um and then you also have a king of cups out here also and this could just be express you know this this person this could be the same person or this could be someone who's conflicted or getting into an argument with a king of cups or about a king of cups okay so if you're a feminine energy and you were dealing with um a a, a man a, a person you might have gotten involved with someone else if there's some type of conflict that maybe one of one of these gentlemen wants to confront you about or confront this other masculine about okay because i see five of wands and this is the king of cups i'm feeling like um huh, tell me about this hold on let me just let me just clarify this because this is took a turn because this is someone here yeah ace of ace of pentacles somebody is um wanting to talk to you possibly i feel some type of conflict about a, a king of cups a new love here or a new offer of love that yeah three of swords somebody's heartbroken or going to be very heartbroken about you moving forward this person keeps tabs on you so i feel like they're going to find out that um you are involved with someone else possibly a king of cups or you could be a water sign i don't know i don't know what this is with these two masculines out here and then there's an emperor out here as well. Okay. And no, no, <laughs> there are no queens or anything out here right now, but there's an emperor. So this could be someone who um, wants to come in and try to take control. There's the empress. The emperor and the empress came out together on top of the Ace of Pentacles. Wow. This is giving me the similar to the reading I did. Was that yesterday where the the uh, king and the queen of wands came out together. Look at this here. Again, emperor, empress comes out together on top of the ace 
of Pentacles. Someone wants to come towards you. I feel like they they may want to start some type of argument or fight with this King of Cups, this person who who's loving on you or you gonna be loving on. Yeah, World card came out. <clears throat> you could have two masculines in their feelings over you, or two people. If if you're a masculine and you deal with you know, feminines, you could have two females that are upset with you. A king of sword and a king of cancer. A king, I said a king of cancer. A king of sword <laughs> could be a cancer. And a king of cups that um, could be feeling some type of way when they find out about <laughs> this new beginning you have with an emperor. Emperor's connection here. Okay. What else do you need to know about this situation? How is it going to be handled? Queen of Pentacles. Okay, Queen of Pentacles comes out. Why is the Queen of Pentacles out here? Hangman. Hey Give me one more. What's this? Why the Hangman out here? Pisces energy. Lovers. Wow. So someone's making a choice. And this choice here, it looks like it's going to be a very um a beautiful connection look at the four of wands coming out here this this is going to be a beautiful connection here i feel wow this is so much similar to energy to yesterday this queen of pentacles gives me that same energy of someone who is um someone is looking at this queen of pentacles as wife material very down to earth very you know takes care of business. Someone is in this Queen of Pentacles and Empress energy and someone's looking at someone's looking at you like this is what I'm feeling. You could be looking at someone like this too. With this hangman, someone is making a making a choice. So if there if if you haven't been approached yet, look at the King of Pentacles kind of coming in reverse. And then you got the Ace of Wands. Wow. I'm telling you, these these matches are coming out, guys. These these people are coming out. People are getting into unions. They ain't bullshit no more. They want to be with who they want to be with, you know, at all costs here. And I'm just seeing that there are going to be some upset people over unions coming together. Because you got the King of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles. You've got the uh, Empress and the Emperor. Now, that King of Pentacles was kind of coming in reverse. So, some of you, I don't know, at one point, maybe you were connecting with someone and maybe this person here was um you thought was a king of pentacles you might have had to release this this person in the past or something i feel like there's more than one person wanting to sit on the throne with you and what it is is that someone's had to make a choice a difficult choice as to who's the better fit and i'm sorry but the emperor and the empress going to gonna always um trump these other stuff now the king of pentacles queen of pentacles that's nice nice but this can also speak of a couple a married couple and this king of pentacles coming out in reverse could indicate that someone was trying to remove their self from a marriage to um because they were in their head with this hangman over another choice so you have in some cases this is someone who has had a family and was trying to leave a, a situation behind um to come towards you but some of you have made a decision here that you you're going to go with the higher level of commitment with someone else clarify this temperance so someone wants to heal something bring balance to something um sagittarius energy hold on why is temperance out here eight of cups yeah Someone, someone walked away from something, um, so that they can go, that so that they can heal. And I feel like someone walked away from something and they walked right into, um, oh, what's this? Queen of Sword in reverse. Damn. Hmm. <laughs> Fell right on top of that Queen of, uh, Queen of Pentacles. Someone walked away from something here. Um. And they're going into a divine union. And then you have someone else here with the queen of sword in reverse. Now, I don't know if this is your energy or this is someone else here who's upset. The high priest. Yeah, this was someone who might have been um, 
a secret here. Oh, and the hermit comes out. Yeah, someone in this situation, whether it was you or someone else, someone was like hidden off. Someone might have been keeping a queen of sword in reverse um, secret or you might have become this queen of sword in, in reverse once you found out that someone was trying to keep you a secret. But nevertheless, you, you, you got something else coming in. You don't even have to worry about that. I think you leaving that behind. Whoever this king of pentacles that was coming out in reverse is, I feel like he was trying to leave a situation. Um, and he might have been trying to sneak off. Somebody somebody in this is upset. There's a queen of sword in reverse out here. <clears throat> What's up with this queen of sword in reverse? Oh, page of sword. So this queen of sword in reverse is watching somebody. The Wheel of Fortune. Huh. Why is the Wheel of Fortune? Ten of Wands. Someone's watching someone like who's on top of the wheel. Someone's doing good or going to be doing good. And it's going to be a burden to someone else. Yep. Five of, a four of cups. Someone withdrew from a situation. Someone withdrew from a person. Someone's in like regret depressed upset um because they have to watch they're watching someone else like have good fortune here so this person who you could be moving into a union with may have left a situation left the relationship left something behind and it's going to upset some feminine energy here and uh, uh, yeah i think you're going to have multiple people watching you Watching your connection, trying to um, get information on you and your person. But these are people that are in regret or going to be in regret for um, either not taking you serious or that, that you know, you, you didn't choose to be with them. So you've got some people here. Yeah, six of swords. You decided to go on to calmer waters. You made a decision that certain people in your life would not be going with you. You chose best for you or you will be choosing what is best for you. But you have people watching you and try to stay close to you. Yeah, five of pentacles to a cup. There are people that feel that you um, would, withdrew yourself from them and you left them hanging um, so that you can be in a union with someone else. And they're a little upset. Are they going to be? And they're going to be trying to keep tabs on you. They're going to be trying to communicate with you in various ways. But um, <laughs> hey, it is what it is at the end of the day, right? It is what it is because some of these people were already in situations. You got the butterfly and you have the keys on a ring. Relationships evolve into the next phase. And many options, decisions. I feel that you have a lot of decisions. The person you were with may have had decisions. You both may have made other people feel that they were an option or people made you feel like this. Whatever the case was or is, you have a relationship that's going to the next phase and um, you're, cutting, you're cutting people off. And a lot of these people were trying to string you along anyway. They were trying to keep you as an option. But you have something for them because... You, <laughs> you have a real connection that's, that's coming in that you don't need multiple people to keep you happy just one person why am i feeling that yeah some of you're gonna have somebody that checks off all the boxes for you that um you don't you don't need multiple people to make you happy you're gonna have one person and that person's gonna keep you happy and i feel like i could be talking to someone who may have in the past kept your options open you could have had you know, people, you had options and you could have been a person that didn't want to settle if you were a masculine or however it goes. Because you could be meeting a masculine who sees you as the world if you're a feminine. And they don't need all of these different people anymore because you're going to satisfy them. Some of you have been dealing with some very self-absorbed one-sided relationships. So that's over. And whoever the people are, the person is, this narcissist, they're watching they're looking, they're stalking, okay? This person's been gaslighting you in the past. You're done with all of that. You're done with that. And, you know, they're going to be upset. Who cares? <laughs> Who cares? Like, 
it's time to move on. You're moving away from that type of stuff. There's a beautiful empress and emperor out here that came out together on top of the Ace of Pentacles. I wouldn't trade that in for any of this foolishness. Not for this King of Wands, Sor. I had the King of Wands didn't come out, but the um, not for this King of Sor, this King of Cups, this Queen of Wands in reverse. Now this Queen of Pentacles, I don't know. I feel like this Queen of Pentacles could be that Queen of that Queen of Sor in reverse. I don't know. Well, it could have been your energy towards these people. You you might have turned up on them. You know, cut them off and had to turn up on them and show out. I don't know. Everybody's story is going to be different. You have people that were dealing with addictions. Or you could have been dealing with addictions. Or this is someone who's addicted to your energy. This narcissist person who's watching you and trying to get close to your friends and family. Yeah, but you need to clear your energy and focus on yourself. Um, and then you have mastery. You've learned a spiritual lesson when it comes to this person. So this this um, cycle is closed out with these people. This could have been your twin flame. This is a divine counterpart connection. So I feel like you're going to always have some type of love for this person. Do you have decisions? It's time to decide about this relationship. So some of you have to decide with this about your twin flame if you believe in that journey. Because you have a true love that is already a part of your life. Or maybe your true love is your twin flame that you're that you're coming into this connection with. I don't know. But you have true love that's already a part of your life. For some of you, you're already in this emperor empress uh connection that's gonna be beautiful and fruitful. And there's these other people that are gonna really try to convince you to um to reconcile with them. And I just don't see many of you wanting to return back to these things to 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 this behavior i mean do you want to be in a queen of store in, in reverse energy where you coming off as bitter cruel harsh you know and because these type of relationships with these narcissists that's what that turns you into a queen of store in reverse you want to be in your empress energy you want to be in your feminine energy i feel many of you just don't want to be arguing anymore you don't want to be going through all the drama anymore you're being told to pay attention to the red flags, okay? So whatever decision you make, old or new, whatever, pay attention to the red flags when it comes to the people that are coming towards you. And I feel like you and your person gonna going to go off and retreat, spend your time together, and leave these people behind. I know my phone just going off back there. That was a confirmation for something. But, yeah, so prepare yourself for this beautiful relationship. Finances and careers, financial issues um, are a factor in your love life right now. So some of you could be dealing with some financial issues, but I feel that um, that's about to turn around as well. Be careful about people trying to connect with you for financial gain, okay? Because some of you are coming out as this queen of pentacles. People see you as, you know, the money tree. And we know that money don't grow on trees and People need to go out there and get it themselves, but, you know, be careful about people trying to co connect with you for the wrong reason. You have someone that's coming in who's going to match you. What I said, reconciliation. There's someone trying to reconcile with you for financial gain, for some type of benefit. So be careful about that person. That's who you're being told to pay attention to the red flags regarding, um, because, Stay focused on the new. Stay focused on, on the divine union that's coming in. And even if you see that that new connection is not mounting up, you pay attention to the red flags with that. But somebody's about to um somebody's about to meet meet their emperor emperor empress. So all right guys, I'm gonna I'm gonna move on from this. I'll do another one shortly. Um see you guys on the next one.